And uh, can imagine over the years a rivalry could develop between these two. It, you seem like in every sport there is kind of a regional rivalry between Reno and Fresno teams and excited to see this one here. Ribeiro gets his foot on it, it's stopped by Marcinkowski. Yeah, definitely, and that was without Christian Pulisic as well. Marie, the header, Chow, and saved by Rainish. Step backwards in the last moment was what saved him there. Ian, who really is one of the most dynamic players in the USL. And there's a reason why he was... Van Avik and another save by Reynish, but Reno right now is living in Fresno's half of the... His new position here at center back, he, he's almost a new man. He's been very solid with Zach Carroll. Big win there by Marie and off the bar. Marie, and that one is cleared away. Brown got his foot on it. And Paul Marie has been so dangerous early on. Here we see him find Mo Chow, and Mo Chow just tries to slot it into that far post. So unfortunate to see it hit the... Barrera keeps it in play. Camden Fawo Redirected and into the back of the nets. And Fresno has taken the first lead of the Knights. Cuevas is there to put it away in the far post. The nice tidy finish to put Fresno ahead here at Greater Nevada tonight in USL action than Juan Pablo Coffa and Antoine Opino. Good ball there from Van Avik and redirected into the back. Brian Brown, influential in his first touch of the game. Great ball in from Jerry Van Avik, and Zach Carroll heads it across. Here comes Van Avik. Jerry Van Avik for Mafeka. Deflected and off the end of the fingertips of Kyle Arenas. Oh, and a good run here from Opino. Manages to stay on sides. Opino. Van Avec. And what a save by Rainish. Juan Pablo Caffa sends it wide. A lot of white shirts in Reno's half right now. Ribeiro centers it. Ribeiro again. Baldissimo blocked once. Saved by Morsinkowski. Get something out of this game. Try to walk away with three points. And there's the final whistle in a match that folks here just did not want to see come to an end.